Meteorologist Haley Clausen. I am tracking a low pressure system just off the coast of California. Notice that counterclockwise spin. This is the next storm system that's going to be moving into Southern California tomorrow and it's going to be bringing a variety of changes. So let's break it on down. First, the timing of that precipitation. We are going to be seeing our radar light up along the coastal communities as we head closer to the lunchtime hour. Moving into the early afternoon hours, 1, 2 o'clock. That's when we're looking to have our best opportunity here in the Coachella Valley and surrounding deserts. Notice there's even some blue on here. More snow is headed our way as well. So even though this isn't going to be the most impactful system, we're not talking about a lot of moisture associated with it. At least it is something. And so that's always a spin, especially because it's been such a dry year. So that's in the early afternoon hours as we continue through the rest of the afternoon and into the evening. Still really going to be focusing a lot of activity up on our local mountains and then down towards the south and San Diego County. That's where uh, some of the higher accumulation totals are looking to take place. As as we make our way into the evening and tomorrow night, well, generally we're going to be watching a clearing take place. So here's a look at some of those future rainfall estimates. Overall, these have been trending down and with less than a tenth of an inch in the forecast. So this is really what we're looking at. It's not a lot, but at least it is something. Notice higher amounts closer to a quarter of an inch around Anza as well as Beaumont, but here in the desert, hundreds of an inch is what's expected. There's also a winter weather advisory for our local mountains above 5,000 feet. This goes into effect at one o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So if you do have to travel on mountain roads, just be aware that fog and falling snow could be reducing your visibility. We're also going to be dealing with some wind. Not a lot, but really our peak gusts around the desert are going to range from 25 to 35 miles per hour as we head into the afternoon, staying breezy through the rest of the day as that system slides from west to east across Southern California. On your Comfort Air 7-day forecast, a big shock when we're talking about our afternoon temperatures in the 60s tomorrow, but we'll be warming up nicely into the 80s by Friday. John Karen. All okay, right. I like the sound of that. Definitely. Thank you.